it's Jazz. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're returning subby, what's up, sis? I am out on a Sunday morning, early on a Sunday morning, because I have things to do. We normally do not do Sunday resets, and y'all know I've talked about that several times in um, videos, because Sundays aren't realistic to us. However, today, I am going to try my best to reset. The house is in shambles, and it's time to get the house back in order. So, I not only have to get the house back in order, but I have errands to run. I just like Starbucks. I got me a grilled cheese, and I got me a refresher. I have to go to Crocs at the Tiger Outlets. <clears throat> Once I leave Crocs, I am going to go by Kirkland's to return these pillows that's been sitting in my garage for about three weeks now. It's time to get them and exchange them. Then once I leave there, I'm trying to make sure I'm going the right way. Once I leave Kirkland's, I need to go grocery shopping. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to go to Trader Joe's, but I really want to. So, let's run in and start doing the things that need to Okay, so I wanna show y'all everything that's in here. I just did my return, but this music is super loud and I do not wanna be copyrighted. So, I'm just going to put some music over what I see because they have some really good stuff in here. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Tell them dim the lights down right now. Put me in the mood. I'm talking about dark room perfume. Go, go. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. Mm. And I know you taste this a little bit. Mm, high maintenance. Mm. Everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice, poetic justice. So this is not intended, but I got two trays. Got a basket to put on the side of the couch, four blankets. I got, what, five, what, six pillows. I got these cute little links. I got four sets of gold forks and two of these chandeliers for one. One on one thirty-eight. This is Ain't home is sorry. They say conversation. Rule a nation. I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs unless I write it down for real. P.S. I really hope you play this. Cause oh girl, you test my patience with all these seductive photographs and all these one-off vacations you've been taking. Clearly a lot for me to take. Oh, this is amazing. I like it. Oh my God. That's amazing. I am so dumbfounded. I'm so dumbfounded. I did not have to pay anything out of pocket today because I used my Kirkland's card. I was not, I, God did this for me because I was not supposed to. I, I was not. God did this for me because I wasn't supposed to come in here today. And by now, y'all know that we're moving. And, oh, where's that room? By now, y'all know that we're moving. And our electrician told us to go pick out lights from this place called Magnolia Lighting so that he could put up our lights. And I wanted a boho light. Do y'all know how much those boho lights are? Like hundreds of dollars. 
God did this for me. This was a God thing. This was nothing but a God thing. God did this for me because he know that I'm... God did this for me, okay? He know I wanted these. I'm not finna cry. Y'all probably like, girl, why are you getting emotional over Kirkland's? Because... I want to do a certain thing in my home. <laughs> this is my first home. This is our first home. And I want it to look a certain way. I'm not in a rush to do it or anything like that. But I was wanting those lights so bad. I have been TikToking about how to do this and all that type of stuff. And they only had two left. I have two places where I'm trying to put my my uh, pendants, lot like pendant lights. It's God did this for me. He know the stuff I've asked for. I have prayed about some stuff. Man, wet pillows. Prayed this house. Prayed for. It was such a struggle. God did this for me. And I don't care what nobody say. And I don't care how nobody feel. Girl, you should not be getting emotional over that now, cause God did that for me. Because only God know the stuff I've been talking to Him about. And God did this for me. Because he know what I wanted. And he gave me exactly what I wanted. <sighs> All right, y'all. Let's go on Rack Room Shows. Because Crocs is temporarily closed at Tanger Outlet. So, let's go return these Crocs. Okay, y'all. So, I'm home. And we are... All putting up groceries. So, I'm about to start... My time lapse so that we can work through here. So yeah, B-roll, three, two, what you know about living on the top? Penthouse suits looking down on the op. Took her for a test drive, left them on the lot. Time is money, so I spend it on the watch. Hold on, little titty showing through the white teeth. You can see the thong busting on my tight jeans. Okay. Rocks on my fingers like a nigga wife me. Got another shitty shit, ain't nothing like me. Yeah, but I got you. of games and this is the last game of the week so come on girl let's go it's not friday it's tuesday it's tuesday <laughs> today we're at baseball. We're at baseball. We're at Alan's baseball. We're at Alan's baseball. Are you excited? Yeah. Do you want brother boy to win? Yeah. Even though they just got through arguing in the car. And I want to give him some coins. Oh, she said she want to give him some coins. They literally just got through arguing in the car and I have to take their TVs for the night. Mm-hmm. But now she's happy for me. Oh, because I need to tell on you. Mm-hmm. In Target with my brother. He's doing some kind of experience. Please ignore my jacket. That day I had just grabbed it out of the dryer, so it's a little wrinkled, so ignore it. Experiment. I have tasted tasted those and they were nasty. It's not an experiment. It's not an experiment. What is it then, Jay? Okay, he has to do a final project for his studies. But you know what I'm doing? For his stats. But you know what I'm gonna do while he in here? I am scanning stuff for my house registry, homewarming registry, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to be productive while he being productive. And get a few things that I need as well. As well. 
Oh yeah, that's what we don't want. And that's pretty much have been my day. We have been packing up stuff today. And I'm also in here to get a bookshelf. If y'all know the infamous Romy Central bookshelves, it is my goal and my dream to have an Ikea closet, but those Ikea closets are expensive and I'm more than sure y'all know that. So the Romy Central bookshelves that I've been seeing everybody get on TikTok, I'm here for it. But you know what's crazy? I've been buying those bookshelves before they went viral. But um, I was using them for something different, so. <sighs> I am regular peanuts. Yeah, cause I see cashews, I see sea salt. No, never mind. Yeah, I don't see regular peanuts. But yeah, I've been buying those bookshelves before they went viral, so. I am about to, um, what is this? I've never seen this before. It's like an immunity. Creamy juice. But I'm rambling. When I see y'all, I'll see y'all over at the bookshelves that I'm talking about. So we're still in Target, as y'all can see. But I took a seat in the little rocker that's by the baby area. But... They have to, not to, they have taken, uh, oh, I look buff. Wait a minute, that's not cute. Mm -mm. <laughs> they have, oh my God, why do I look so buff? You know what, whatever, y'all know I ain't buff. But um, they have taken all of the bookshelves. They have taken all of the bookshelves. Um, So now I gotta wait for bookshelves to actually get back in stock. Is that? So it's like 12 games in one. Why are you sitting in these people's chair? Get up. Because I want to. Pampas grass. Well, Pampas spray. Yeah, it's 12 games in one. Do you need that? I don't need it, but it's for my house. Oh, yeah, my brother's moving too. He's going back to school to go back to Oxford. He's already back in school. Well, he's already back in school. He's moving back to Oxford. Um, so when I move in, he'll be next. So we have to get his stuff together too. So I'm definitely, I'll be recording it too. It's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. I'll call y'all back. I'll, I'll talk to y'all later. Those are so cute. I love how they look. It's like that suede feel. Pampas Campbell? They're all right there. Yeah. Those are 20. So y'all, let me tell y'all, I seen a girl on TikTok talking about how when she moved into her new home, that she wanted to have a signature. That smells salt. That smells good. Yeah, that smells good too. She was saying how she wanted to have a signature smell when she moved. So she was buying like all of the same exact candles for her house so she could have a signature scent and that makes so much sense. So, y'all have told y'all about Pampas candles before, and that's going to be my signature scent because Pampas smells so good. Oh, what is this? This, um, this? Grapefruit oh. basil. It smells good. It's just, how much is it? $40 for a candle. <laughs> you probably get it from uh, Whole Foods. Um, Home, Home Goods. goods. Home goods just isn't consistent enough. Okay, right. No, Maybe. because you'll find a candle in there today. You probably won't find it the next so. month. I wonder how long these diffusers last. I don't know, but I put one on my uh, house registry. They're the same price as the candles. Yeah. And I also use that pampas spray in my car too, because it smells so good. It's like a very s soft scent. This is cute and different. I haven't seen anything like this before. So y'all know like our style, it's gonna be like boho, but Afro boho. 
So color scheme is going to be a lot of browns, blacks, whites, greens. I'm not the neutral girl. I'm not the, I'm not the, what do they call them? What do they call them? New moms? What do they call them? Neutral moms, I think. I'm not that girl. I like greens and stuff like that. So yeah. That one is nice, but I feel like it'll tumble over. Yeah, I somehow feel like you're just doom, 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 doom. Oh, okay. Let's not. Oh, this is hard. No, it's supposed to be. This is so hard. They want to be comfortable. Good morning, guys. I'm in Target because I just got a notification that they have the white bookshelves here. Y'all know I'm looking for those. I'm looking for one for me and one for my mom. So I'm about to go back here and hopefully I can find them. So let's go. Okay, so I'm here, but I don't see them. I only see these and I see brown. They're technically supposed to have black in here. Oh, Jesus. The pressure is getting worse. The pressure is getting worse. I don't see them. I don't see them, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Let me go ask somebody. Because I got, I'm not leaving here without these. Yes, ma'am. And I only see brown. You know, I bet I've seen a couple more of the espresso in the back, but that's supposed to be black. That's supposed to be black. Let's see, one, two, two, three on the floor, zero on in the back, and none on here. So I'm not something in there, no. Because I have a lot of the short ones, but the short ones don't do. The justice that the, the five, five shepherd, shepherd, yes. Oh, you have to stack. Oh, God. Yeah, you can't mm -hmm. stack I can't. Mm -mm. No, <laughs> no, so. Goodness. Yeah. You have absolutely no floors right here. Okay. Let me go look in another spot and I'll go check the back. Yes, ma'am. If I find them, how many are you looking for? I need two. Okay. We ended up finding the two for me and my mom, so we're good to go. Okay, y'all. Sorry the angle is so weird, but um, I don't know if y'all ever remember me talking about, um, it was on a couple vlogs ago, how I needed to get the kids a new comforter set because something is going on like the, um, what is it? It's like chipping or something like that, but I have them a pillow fort comforter. So I ended up calling um, customer service and I was like, hey, you know, can I send this in through y'all and y'all send me another one? Like, I just want the same one to just, you know, get over it or whatever. She was like, oh, anything that is Target and Target own brand pillow fort would be um you'll be able to return that you have a year warranty so i got the kids both the kids a comforter one in september september 2nd the other september 4th and she was like oh it hasn't been a year yet take the comforter take it back and get you a brand new comforter so if you did not know target owned brands can be returned up to one year just make sure you have your receipt having your target app is very important with that being said, the kids need new comforters, so I'm trying to see how do I want to go about doing their rooms. Um, their rooms will be kind of like the last thing to be decorated, um, where their beds will be the last thing to be put up. I'm going to try to decorate like room by room or whatnot. So, oh, look at that. They have a tooth pillow. Now, where was this when we just did this whole little tooth fairy thing for Alan? That's all right. We're going to get one for Addie and put it out. But I have been looking at, like, room makeovers. I don't want to do anything too specific. Like, I don't want to do, um, 
Well, I can't really say that. Okay, I don't want to do anything specific on the walls. I'll say that. I would love to have wallpaper for Addie's room and Alan's room, but I have to make sure that they don't clash. So, these sheets are very cute. Y'all see those? Super, super cute. Um, and you can accent with the yellow. And we have a yellow um, blanket from Pillow Fort already. Um, when it comes to Alan stuff, uh, we think we're gonna keep the dinosaur theme. I wanted to do the dinosaur theme with Addie, but kids change so much what they like and all that kind of stuff. So I don't want to be, um, you know, like dead it them down on exactly the theme in their room. Does that make sense? I think that makes sense. I think that makes sense. But Addie is infatuated with dinosaurs right now, so. I'm going to go home and I'm going to ask her what does she want in her room. If she says she's want, she wants dinosaurs, then guess what? We're going to do dinosaurs in her room. So, um, if not, we're going to do some, something just dainty and simple. But I need to look at wallpaper before I really decide on the theme because I don't want to get her, like, flower wallpaper and dinosaur sheets. Like, that's too much. But I love these. Like, look how cute that is. I love it. And like I said, she's infatuated with dinosaurs. Both of them are. Alan's room is dinosaur thing too. Let's see. If I can go and show y'all his dinosaur decor. Okay, so Alan has these sheets here. Alan has these sheets. And he has, oh, he has a navy comforter. So he has this comforter right here. And it's plain. So that's what I say about, you know, plain stuff. So I'm going to see how he feels. If you want to keep dinosaurs, then we're going to constantly do dinosaurs. But I seen these the other day. And I thought they were so cute. So we're definitely in the market for new kid stuff but i think i'm about to get out of here and go home and we're about to get through packing tomorrow is closing day um so we have to have things in order for that so yeah the closing day vlog will be out before this um it'll be closing day vlog empty house tour then we're gonna start with the moving vlogs which is this one so yeah um I'm probably going to see y'all when I get home because I'm more than sure I'm about to take the kids' decor off of their walls once I get to that. Yo, it's Jazz. If you are new here, welcome. If you're returning subby, what's up, sis? So, we are at Target, at Target y'all. It is Sunday. It is May 7th, and we are about to do a huge pickup order because we are, what are we doing today? go to the upstairs house we're moving out this is our official start of our moving vlog we get, um, something. Yes, uh, like some, uh, <laughs> something like the, the child she glitching uh, we at target we can do a huge pickup order okay so we're gonna take y'all in inside once i leave here we're going to Starbucks to get you something to drink. Um, water. You want water from Starbucks? Milkshake. Milkshake. Frappuccino. Anyway, go to Starbucks, get her a Frappuccino. Probably going to get like a grilled cheese. I'm obsessed with their grilled cheese now if you haven't had it. Get it and get it cooked open-faced, okay? Um, and I'm probably going to get me a refresher more than likely and go to my parents' house. And my dad has a leaf blower that we need because we got to blow the garage out. Um, and do, 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 what else? Oh, we gotta get his like his hoe to like pull up grass and all that kind of stuff and chop that up. So, and after that, we're going to start. AJ went to his dad's house to get the trailer. So, after that, we're going to really just start moving things in. It's gonna be like slow and steady. We have a week and a half to get out of, out of our apartment, so we're going to be um. We're gonna like move like a little at a time. So today 
we're doing like living room and garage um tomorrow we're probably gonna do like um we're probably gonna do like um like our kitchen area or whatever so yeah y'all we got a lot of stuff that we're gonna do so y'all are on this journey with us and we're so excited are you excited yeah yeah, so y'all, yesterday, if y'all follow what? me on social media, like on my Instagram and TikTok, y'all should know, Addie won first place in her division yesterday for the Mississippi Hydrangea Queen, ages two to three. So my baby was crowned queen yesterday, so me. she was, okay? So that's her second beauty pageant. She did so well. She got this smile, and she won first place, so... We we had a good weekend, y'all. So it's back to the nitty gritty, and we gotta work. So I'll see y'all in Target. Yeah, our Target is doing a whole rebuild in here, and they are getting a Starbucks. But unfortunately, this ain't the Target that I'll be close by when we move. We're going to Starbucks, remember? Let's get our stuff. All right, y'all. Oh, bag. Basket is secure. It's so much stuff and it's so heavy. We got stuff all at the bottom of here too. When I say packed to capacity, I mean just that Addie just has a place for her to sit at. Absolutely not, friend. Absolutely not. Look, leave me alone. So yeah, we still got a lot of stuff to get and even that crap up there. AJ just went to take the trash for the trash chute and he has his trailer over there as you can see. So I'm waiting on him to get back so and I hear I hear his truck. You gotta use so I can hear it. I'm waiting on him to get back around here so we can go ahead and start packing out stuff. I look bald. This this blowing ain't blinding like it's supposed to, but whatever. I can hear him coming around the corner. He better not be flying. Look at him. All right. So now we got to start putting stuff on the back of here. Can't even drink Cristal on this one. I got my gosh another seven on right now. You gotta puff a J to this one. Can't roll a blunt up to this one, boy. Okay, y'all, so everything is unpacked, and I want to go over exactly what I bought from Target. Remember, I told y'all that I got a lot of stuff from Target. So, let's start here. This was $296 worth of stuff. We got a two-pack of Lysol, a Dirt Devil vacuum cleaner, shower S hooks, Magnolia um, Pepper Spray, let me see. Magnolia Pepper Spray. Y'all know I taught y'all about wanting to have a signature scent here. And boom, there we go. Um, get a little lower. We have some apple juices. If you know about the Martinelli's, then you know, okay? Excuse the kids. <laughs> soap. We also got some cucumber melon pump soap. Alan likes that kind. Vinyl gloves. Tissue. Um, carpet odor eliminator. Paper towels. Whoop, Clorox spray, got Clorox wipes, we got the um, tabs for the toilet, we got actual bleach here, we got some dishwasher packs, I just put some in so I can start washing out the dishwasher, I wanted to run a few times, you know, to get whatever they had out of here, um, two Pampas candles, these were $20 each, the shower rod was $22, um, and the foam mat, so... Yeah, y'all, this was $294 worth of stuff we're moving in. So, 
what I'm about to do now is I am about to go ahead and start um, trying to clean up. Um, my child ran through it without a shirt, sorry. Um, getting ready to get ready to start cleaning up, like I said. Uh, we lice out everything already. About to clean up countertops, wipe down knobs, uh, like, you know, little spots, ends, and outs in here. Um, tomorrow is the day that we're really going to start the um decorating process we got everything in a garage baby i gotta eliminate something i have to eliminate something out of that garage but other than that y'all let's go ahead Ooh, let's go ahead and start putting up things i have had people buy stuff off my registry already and if you want to purchase us something i will put our registry down in the bottom um we're registered at target Amazon and Walmart, all three stores have different things, so therefore that's why I registered three different places. So, let's get into some cleaning, girl, because it's a lot we gotta do, but we got a house, we got a house. Hey guys, it's the next day. Remember I told y'all that I was, um, what did I tell y'all I was doing? About to clean up yesterday? That didn't happen. Hold on, I'm gonna sit y'all down. Yeah, that didn't happen the way I thought it was gonna happen. So, we came back to the apartment last night because we hadn't eaten all day. So, I am about to start putting up stuff, as y'all can see. I am oh my God, trying to figure out how I can cover this pantry so I won't get all over my truck. But, it's, it's giving hard. Hold on, I'm making up. So I got that done, and now I gotta put it in the actual car. Because yeah, that's how we're gonna, that's how we're gonna carry this. So let's go ahead and, oops, put this in the car because I've already started putting things in that's supposed to be in. So today is living room and kitchen stuff. So therefore that's what I'm moving. Um, so yeah, AJ left to go and um, get the water turned on and all that kind of stuff, like in our name. I'm sweating. And get the water and all that kind of stuff turned on in our name. So now, this is what we're doing. We're waiting and we're gonna pack the kitchen and the living room. Um, I'm about to get down there and clean up. My brother is supposed to be up here when he get through working out. And after that, um, I think we're gonna probably go start setting the living room. So I'm gonna cut off like this vlog when we actually start to um oh my god, brain fart. <laughs> I'm gonna actually cut this vlog off when I'm through cleaning so that y'all can get a living room decor vlog. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do now. So right now I guess I'm gonna put this on a little time lapse lapse and go ahead. So we stopped by Target here. before we went back down there and look how cute these cups are. Look at these little cups. These are so cute. And I got a coconut and they have this one like the little fish in it. Y'all can't tell me they're like cute. Bro, how do I not get out of Target without spending less than $100? So I had to buy snacks to oh, <laughs> have snacks and all that kind of stuff together for the house a hundred and thirty seven dollars i got plates and you know different things too but good god wasn't okay, expecting that to come into lowe's because your girl got a it's over there too oh okay your girl has an ant problem we just found it in the window when we were cleaning so we had to come in here to try to find something because absolutely freaking not Okay. I think my daddy was saying something like that. Uh, uh, there you go. Where? Oh, there we go. See, this is the one that AJ had with the little squirt on the side. That right there. Yes, that's the one I 